hello everyone welcome to my channel so in this video i'll be showing you how we can manage multiple java version in mac os so it's been common these days uh, like we have to install multiple java version basically to tackle like some old legacy systems are built in some older versions and we are you know migrating these days to latest java version be it in any lts version or the current java version according to the need okay so i'll be showing you how we can manage multiple java version so let's start so i'll be showing you first in a ide way so i'm going to show you the same in intellij idea so suppose if you are working in any project and suppose you wanted to switch in between so in ide it's quite simple you need to you know go to the file in windows and in intellij idea menu item icon and settings and then you know you need to open project so let me just open project okay it's in the project structure in the file menu item icon so in the project you can see i have selected module sdk as java 13 okay but my project uh, you know have till java 17 you know i have installed but in this specific module i have selected java 13 in all these module if i'm going to show you here java 13 is selected all of these modules okay so you can change according to your need like which java version you need it so in id you can manage any java version according to the need okay same with the spring tool suit and eclipse also now i'm going to show you in the spring tool suit in the spring tool suit suppose if you are going to create a new project then i'm just going to show you a new java project okay or a pre okay in eclipse i have i can show you okay so you can select any java version you wanted to set while creating a new project in spring also while creating a boot project you can also set a java version okay so similarly in any id you can set it but uh, but some of the legacy projects you wanted to you know run from the terminal or console so where we face such challenges so i'm going to show you in the terminal i'm going to open terminal in mac os and let me just zoom it out and i'm just going to show you java version i have installed in my system so you can see these three java versions are currently present on my system 17.0.4.1 and 1.8 and if i show you the current java version so i have selected java 1.8 because i was working on some project so i need the 1.8 dependency i do not need the latest 17 or the lts java version dependency okay but if you you know i wanted to switch the same so i can also do so so you need to have the shell file in your machine how you can do so echo dollar shell to find out which current shell you are using so i am using z shell some of your systems if you are using older mac systems intel based systems so you might have using the bash profile so you can also create one or you will be having that okay so i'm not going to show you how we can install multiple java version i'll be creating a separate video where i'll be showing you how we can install multiple java version in mac os and in windows also so here i have installed multiple java version i'm going to only show you how you can manage okay how you can switch in between these multiple java version though there is a tool j environment through that you can also do and we can also create some scripts through that we can also create but i am going to show you a manual a simplicity way uh, so that everyone can you know switch in between their multiple java version so now i'm going to open my z shell and here you can see i have exported both of my java 17 and java 18 now i have commented the java 17 now let me uncomment it and comment out the java 8 and to save the file you need to press escape colon wq and to edit escape then shift plus i button to insert any data okay so i'm going to save it and now i'm going to close my terminal to close the terminal you need to press exit okay now i'm going to close the terminal 
now I'm again going to open it to verify my changes so I'm going to write Java version so you can see I have switched to Java 17 now both JDK and JRE has been switched to Java 17 so in this way you can manage and switch in between multiple Java versions on your Mac OS so that's it for today thank you